Player! And with that, welcome to Way of the Wyvern episode 16. Today we are gonna play a little game. So as you noticed, um, we are both on the Kagura. I'm Blue and me, Don Vippo. And you have to guess who is who. Of course, the reveal will be uh, within this video because, yeah, one of these two fine folks is gonna end up in losers. And if you win, you can request a video in the comments. I mean, you can do that either way. And if you lose, you have to subscribe. Those are the rules. So have fun guessing who's who and I'm gonna comment and with I'm Vipo on Don Blue. So Don Blue got the Y1. No, I'm Vipo dot got the Y1. I'm confused myself. Don Blue got hit by the Y1. And I'm Vip Vipo sec secures the first round. Strong start, half half of his health is still, is still there. And Don Blue got the 6B but he didn't believe and didn't um, cash out. So I'm Vipo is getting him another hit in because of that. So, uh, both players are feeling each other out. Lots of jumping here going on. No one wants to deal with Kagura, but they both have to deal with Kagura. But Don Blue gets in. Nice dance cancel. A agreeable burst from I'm Vipo. He needs to get out of the corner and quick. And Don Blue with another simple combo. Putting him putting I'm Vipo in the corner again. It's looking dire for I'm Vipo, but he gets the thief half near. Okay, he's trying to stay a little bit safer. He didn't uh, RC though, so no combo there. And this should be it for Don Blue unless he doesn't get the combo, but he dares. So both on uh, both have one round, the next round will decide the game. Okay, both are feeling each other out right now. Nice spacing. Yeah, uh, I'm Vipo getting the first hits in, but Don... Ah, no, punish on the near. you hate to see it. Don Blue had a, a huge chance there, but didn't get it. Oh, this could be huge for I'm Vipo. Yeah, he gets the combo, he gets the conversion. He decides not to take the near uh, guaranteed damage, but instead... In favor of AOP. Nice Lindwurm. And yeah, only a slither of health left. So everything that I'm Vipo can put on the corner will kill. But Don Blue doesn't want to get killed. So he's putting on the aggression here. The black aggression as you call it. And uh, yeah, right now still even. But Don Blue got the burst and he used it there. So he gets in and that should be huge. Uh, combo damage unless he drops of course and he does oh okay but he gets the cardamos and he decides to rapid cancel and gets the full combo first match by one by don blue let's see if i'm Vipo can recover okay round start cardamos from don blue interesting decision there both players are feeling themselves maybe a little bit too much but that's uh, to be uh, to be had in the Kagura matchup. Yeah, I'm Vipo being very defensive right now. Definitely sh uh, shook by the match that he threw away. Yeah, I'm Vipo had the right idea, but he committed to overdrive too early because Don Blue hadn't committed to his drive yet. So it wasn't a dodge. It could have been an. Um, no, it couldn't even have been Exit Axel. And Don Blue looking strong here. I'm Vipo is almost defeated. And he gets him with the raw 6A and he didn't need to follow up with anything. So that was a good decision from Don Blue there. Can I'm Vipo recover? Okay, Beef Hafnir to catch him out of the air. Ah, nice 5B to catch the Hydra there. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I'm Vipo jumped, he shouldn't have done that, or at least he should have barrier guarded with that. Don Blue expecting the burst, but burst was alre already happened. So there was lo lots of uh, damage left on the table. And ah, he wanted to, I'm Vipo wanted to punish with uh, 2B probably, but yeah, didn't get it. Okay, nice bait on the exit axle. Couldn't punish, unfortunately. So I'm Vipo, yeah. Purple throw tech. 
Nice. He's still in there, my my lads. But yeah, can he make it back? Can he turn this around? Or will Don Blue be the victor of this match? Okay, rapid. Don Blue gets his burst back. Okay, decides to burst right away. Good decision. Again, uh, against Kagura, uh, it's burst is very safe. And Don Blue finds the final hit and advances in winners. And that puts I'm Wippo, who was Don Wippo all along in losers. And now, so shook, he couldn't play Kagura anymore. He had to switch. Or I had to switch to Ragnar. Now, the, the real story is that I know that Karubu is a beginner pen player. And I wanted to flex. Now I want to present some character variation here because yeah, only Kagura is a little bit boring if you don't play Kagura yourself. And yeah, I play Ragnar too, a little bit at least. I'd like to play him a little bit more to be honest, but uh, yeah, I am not the research guy and that's putting me off because I feel like I've got the basics down but I need uh, some more juicy combos some better idea how to pressure with him and then I'm go golden but again this is a match against the beginner I don't want to focus too much on myself but of course with Ragnar I could co you could consider me a beginner as well so maybe that's fine so in this match Karubu definitely on the back foot but he finds the right hits, right hits here getting the grab Abusing it, the normal green grab. Okay. Very nice bombo here, but d doesn't finish it. Still gets a 6A there to enter air. And both players, me and Karubu, on a pixel, but Jesus kicked just too good of a button. I press it and I win this round at least. So let's look forward to the next round. Another good 6A doesn't believe again. A little bit too uh, spammy, I believe, on the 6C. Because I believe you can get hit out of it. But of course, I haven't shown him that you can do it. So uh, that's good. Doesn't tag either. So I can get, uh, yeah, fairly good uh, Ragnar damage here. Again, I don't really know his limits or anything. I'm pretty much a scrub. And I could have had, had it there, right there if I had just wanted hey uh, health fang and RC but yeah didn't do that so the match goes on a little bit longer okay Karubu decides to zone uh, me out but yeah I, I find my way in and secure the game so that's the first game on the table for our boy Ragnar the blood edge but will I secure the second game as you saw it it came down to the wire in some of those matches before, so... And Karubu is already showing a strong lead. Good counter here. A nice bait with the present, and I fall for it, of course. That's, again, I already had this, I always fall for the counter. I'm just too unga for my own good. Good uh, Inferno Divider, but very bad burst there. Because all I've gotten from I can get from that is essentially the knockdown and that's not so scary to be wasting the burst there yeah I even get a combo not the best one I know the I know a better one myself but didn't convert and at this one very bad punish from me this could have been game probably if I had the right combo but this time Karubu gets a 6A and converts properly. Well done. Like my steak. But yeah, um, bad jokes aside, let's go into the next round. Inferno Divider! Another throw. They pressed something so they couldn't even tech. So reject miss. And yeah. Let's see. Okay, blocks the first set of Granted Hades. No punish though. Of course, that's a little bit difficult to get the punish because you have to be ready for the follow-up, right? So yeah, uh, better no punish and no, um, yeah, no regret <laughs> at that point. But again, this nicely uh, put.
putting down the bubble with uh, Jesus kick and I was greedy and wanted to do that again with JC but got hit by the bubble and I could have had it there. Karubu was still getting in, in the hit and he realized okay just run up grab will secure me the round. Yeah a burst understandable coming down to the wire Okay, nice. And I get the 6B, the unblockable overhead. <laughs> nah, it's actually pretty good. But uh, high level players will say it's not good. But it's lower levels, it's actually amazing. Okay, another overhead and does it twice and this time gets the conversion with the uh, 2A there. Very nice. And I cut the combo short to get the grab. Looks very uh, commanding from me right now. Or oh, not very, a little bit. I've gotten a slight advantage. We got them in the corner. They burst. Good burst there. Ah, and at this point I grab, the, uh, I drop the combo. That is huge actually, because they would have been almost dead and I only needed one hit. Again, I still only need one good hit. And it goes down to the wire again, apparently. Zoning me out with Poi Poi. Of course, uh, Ragnar doesn't have really that kind of zoning capabilities, right? So his uh, his death spike is only like a gunflame style uh, projectile. And Karubu closes this out, so it's 1-1 one, one again. And I have to say, I'm a fool, I know nothing, and I switch to Bang. But I, maybe I should have stayed Ragnar or of course I played uh, Kagura. You will see shortly why. Of course, I'm spoiling, but you know, you, when you guess from the uh, video lengths, then actually, yeah. And honestly, the reason why probably my bang is underperforming is that this, that the pen had very strong uh, bang players, like or rather two bang players, Koboxel and, uh, and Xenopopo, and I know that Koboxel has leveled up a lot, so yeah. Fighting Goboxel must have uh, leveled them up a lot in this particular matchup because I don't really know how to open them up with my, with the usual bank stuff. Here I uh, yeah I dropped the combo, unfortunately. I mean, of course I don't really have the good combos for Bang. Another crucial drop here, but at this point I get a fatal counter, and I'm not sure if I actually countered the projectile or if. Um, if they just pressed anything afterwards, not the project as a counter. But yeah, at this point it still looks good for me. And um, yeah, Dooming music should be played, but no, it's platinum, so we have to play uh, something, something cheerful, just like herself. And again, hitting good combos here. And I drop all my, all my stuff. Actually, no punch on the 3C, that could have been huge as well for them. Fatal counter on the 6C, I tried to uh, use the drive move there, but wasn't fast enough. Or rather, the drive move wasn't fast enough. Again, purple throws I tech. Uh, green ones, not that much, sometimes. I'm getting better with it. And yeah, at this point I could have gone, uh, gotten a way better combo if I had confirmed they were uh, standing. Good super on the wake up though, because yeah, I was committing to 5C and I couldn't do anything about the super then. Okay, a bit wasteful with the nails as always. Okay, they got 3C out before I get 3C out. So yeah, that's something I uh, have to keep in mind. But yeah, this time always when I get close enough, they just uh, extend a button before me and I get defeated. So, good job on Karubu taking chunks of elo from me. And yeah, I'm el eliminated from the turning with that. I would have played against Ignis afterwards. So yeah, that was my tournament run at Blaze Blue EU Open 23. Uh, tune in for weekly and monthly tournaments. Join those. Uh, also join Salty U, which is bi-weekly and the weeklies at Hard Edge. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a nice day. See you then. Bye bye.